Hello and welcome to the Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith. This is an extra episode for anyone who has purchased the split screens. If you haven't, there's a link at the end for you to be able to pick up 50 animated drag and drop split screens. So uh, I, I created a tutorial on how to make your own, a, a tutorial on how to use the ones that I've created, and I've received a few requests asking how to put multiple clips into the split screen. I'll show you two ways to do this. It's pretty easy. Let's go have a look. So here are all the split screens. These are a bunch of sequences that you can just drag in as I've done here. And when I hit play, they animate and they're filled with placeholders that you can change with your video. So in this large number four area here, we're gonna put multiple clips and that's, that's this bottom placeholder. So one way to do that is to use nested clips. And the nested clip is just another sequence uh, filled with a bunch of cuts. So each one of these is a quick enough cut that you'll see it in that number four. So here is the nested clip sequence. All I need to do is hold the Alt key on Windows option on Mac, and drag this to the bottom and you'll see it will switch. And now when I hit play, there it is. And I still have, and all those clips are there. And I still have control when I select that clip in the effects controls to change the overall position. So we can move that to a certain spot, fill that up and position that so it looks a little bit better. You could also keyframe that if you want. So that's one way to do it. Uh, if you want changes in those clips, double click on, on the nest, it will load it into a sequence, make the change there. And when you go back to this split screen, it'll update. Okay, another way to do that is to use clips themselves. So here I'll just drag in a clip. Again, I'm holding uh, Option or Alt. And this clip shows up here. Uh, I'm going to move this over as far as I can. And then I just start cutting this. So grab the razor tool and just start chopping this up into pieces. Boop, 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 boop. And now go back to the move tool and start grabbing new clips and holding down Alt or Option on any of these. And now each one of these has its own reframe. So if I select that one, you'll see all the same controls over here. So we can reposition that one different from the other ones because it might be slightly different. Um, and this one here, see we can't drag him down. This is shot with him at the top of that clip. So we need to um, press the F key just as I showed in the other tutorial, hit the F key and set a different uh, in point like this one here. Now option or alt drag and flip that out. Okay, so now we've got multiple clips in that number four region and two different ways to do that. And we could also do the same with any of the other uh, of those. So anytime you want to Anytime you want to use any of these amazing split screens and add multiple things inside there, you can. All right, so there you go. Thanks again to everyone who has purchased these split screens. $20 gets you all 50 animated drag and drop split screens and anything else I put on the members section of videoreveal.com. All right, hope that makes sense to you out there and have fun with your split screen.